100,000. 100,000. We did it, y'all. 100,000 subscribers. It's a celebration. I just can't believe it. Last November, I had 6,000 subscribers. I was so proud of my 6,000 subscribers. I was putting out video after video after video for years and years and slowly building my way up. And then all of a sudden, from last November to now, we went from 6,000 subscribers to 100,000 subscribers. You guys have given me so much support and I'm just like, <laughs> I'm so happy right now. This is a crazy milestone, 100,000 subscribers. So we're just gonna, we're gonna do some fun stuff. We're gonna celebrate. I got some cool stuff planned. This is kind of an announcement video. So I'm gonna need some audience participation down in the comments for a lot of this stuff. So we're gonna be doing a giveaway. Duh, let's do that. Let's get some stuff in your hands. We're gonna be doing a q and I haven't done one of these since 10,000 subscribers. We're gonna do an art prompt and I'll get a little bit more details on that in a second. And there's a sale going on right now on my website. And then there's a few other things I wanna talk about, but for the giveaway. <laughs> I'm just so happy right now. This is crazy, y'all. Anyway, for the giveaway. Last time I did a giveaway for the 10,000 subscriber celebration, I limited it to just the United States for some of the stuff, and then international people got other stuff. This time it's everybody everywhere. First of all, I'm gonna be giving away for five people, prints. So something like this, this. All you gotta do to win is put a comment down in the comments. Five of you are gonna win t-shirts, stuff like this. Something like that. You'll just leave a comment down in the comments. We'll pick five of you. And then one person is gonna win an original drawing, something like this. It probably won't be framed, but it'll be an original, let's see, five t-shirts, five prints, one drawing. So there'll be 11 winners on this. Woo! <laughs> All right, so that's that. The Q&A questions. Leave me a question down in the comments. Not only can you ask me a question for the Q&A, but that'll also automatically enter you to win the giveaway. I'll put together a little Q&A video as a celebration for the 100K. We're gonna do that. And then the third thing, uh, the art prompt. I've been doing these art prompts on my Patreon for a long time. We do one every month. Basically, I come up with a theme or a prompt. All of my patrons like make art based around that prompt. They submit it to me and I make a review video where I review everybody's art. And it's cool because like my community on Patreon is really talented and we all kind of share each other's art. But I wanted to open that up for this special celebration to my entire YouTube audience. So. The prompt is exploration. So you can make a drawing, a painting, a, a song, a little video, like whatever kind of art you do, photography, make a piece of art around the theme of exploration and email it to team10hun at gmail.com. Email address is down in the description. Email address is on the screen right now. When you email it to me, send me, if it's an image, try to make sure it's at least 1080 by 1920 pixels so that it'll look good in the review video that I'm gonna make. Also make sure that you send me like your Instagram handle or some other way where I can shout you out because this video is about showing off how talented my YouTube community is so I'm gonna choose some of my favorites and if you make it on the video I'm gonna review your art but I'm also gonna shout you out so that if other people like your art maybe they can follow you or check out some more of what you got going on the only thing is I'm gonna need all this stuff sent to me by June 5th which gives you about two weeks to do this I know it's kind of short notice I need to be able to have time to actually make the video and we're gonna kind of show off how cool and talented this community is fourth thing Having a sale right now on my website. It goes through Sunday, I think uh, May 26th. Basically, if you spend $40 or more on my website, you get a free signed print. There's no coupon code required for that. And then if you spend $80 or more, you get a free print and you get 15% off your order. So check that out if you want to, 1000art.com, free shipping in the US, international shipping available. It's a sale, it's a celebration. <laughs> and then the fifth thing, this doesn't have a whole lot to do with 100K subscribers, but I'm gonna be trying to go to Europe to make some art. I already have like a little collaboration lined up with somebody in Germany. So that's kind of the catalyst for this whole thing. But if you have some walls that you think you could help me lock down, if you have a couch to crash on, if you're an artist in Europe and want to collaborate, basically I need some help to kind of put this little Europe tour together. Shoot me an email to team10hun at gmail.com if you can help me put this thing together. If you're not from Europe and you can't help 
help me on that. If you want to get some t-shirts or some other merchandise from my website to help support me like traveling over to Europe to make a bunch of cool art, that would be super helpful. If you want to become my patron on Patreon, that would also be helpful so I can go over there, make some art, make some cool content, make some videos to show you guys and uh, just like, you know, spread my art around. <laughs> Maybe I can do some meet and greets in Europe too and meet with some of you European fans. But yeah, this is kind of just an announcement video. It's so amazing the support I've gotten from you folks. I've been uploading videos to YouTube. I think my first one was like 10 years ago and I started taking it real seriously maybe like three or four years ago. When I first started out, I never imagined that my art would inspire other people to be more creative, but comment after comment after comment comes through from you folks saying that you like to put my videos on while you're drawing or you watch my videos and then you feel really inspired to make art of your own and that is something I never really planned on, but to me it's one of the coolest and most touching things about this whole experience. So thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for subscribing. Thank you for making this YouTube experience like such a joy for me as an artist. 100K baby, <laughs> we did it, this is crazy. But to make this video so it's not just a super boring announcement video, I'm gonna do a little tour of my shop statics here. Uh, I get a lot of comments asking for me to do like a statics tour. So there's a special bonus. And uh, let me show off kind of my shop, my gallery, and let you guys kind of see the inside scoop on what's going on here. I've met so many of you here in my shop and it's so awesome. Like it's, it's a pretty crazy experience. It's only started happening over the past few months. I used to like never meet anyone who knew me from YouTube. And now it's a pretty regular occurrence. So thank you to all of you who've actually been here before. But for those of you who haven't, here's a little tour of my shop. 100K! <laughs> this is crazy. So this is the shop. Over on this wall, I got a bunch of my artwork, paintings, and some G clay print. Kind of along here, I got some of my hats, some beanies. These guys were out of stock for a super long time, but the guy who collaborated on these with me found a random box of like 75. Those are the last ones they'll ever be. These ones are new, the Ten Hun Triangle logo. And then kind of along here, I do these like custom paint pants. And then I have a lot of my hoodies and outerwear, crew necks. These ones are pretty popular with the sleeve print. These pink uh, crew necks are pretty popular. I got some jackets. And then this is kind of the main t-shirt display. I probably have well over a thousand garments in here. <laughs> so I've been doing merchandising of my art long before I started YouTube. A lot of YouTubers like start their YouTube channel and then try to figure out their merch. But for me, it kind of went the other way around where I've had a shop and I've had an online store and I've been putting my art on like t-shirts and prints and stuff for a long time before I really started messing with YouTube or especially before like my YouTube started doing really well. There's a bunch of women garments up there. There's a bunch of the leggings that I do. These are kind of the 10 hundies. Art for your butt. The problem that I face is I just have like so much stuff and I just trying to make it not look like just a crazy... <laughs> I don't know, I just I just do more is more. Bunch of prints in there. These are some snowboards I did with No Bad Day. These are like the samples that they gave me. You can get those on the No Bad Day website. Pretty rad. It's limited edition skateboards. These might be sold out. Once I check the orders that we have, because we got that sale going on right now, I'm pretty sure those decks that are sitting right there are actually all sold out online. And then this is like our main counter where we kind of hang out. We do a lot of our shipping from there. We ship everything out of this store by hand. We don't have like some third party people who ship for us. Up here is kind of like a grid of prints. That's just like a small portion of the prints that I have. This is a collaboration piece between me and an artist named Katie Kirkji. She does like sculpture art and she chops up musical instruments. Her work is super rad. This is like our local music section right here. These are all Seattle musicians. This back corner here is a company in Japan called Taimado and they sell my stuff in Tokyo and Osaka and I sell their stuff here. We're like sister businesses. Up here is kind of a grid of t-shirts. That's not even all the t-shirts I have. It's kind of like as many as I can fit. This building is like super old. It's like over a hundred years old. So there's all this exposed brick and it's just kind of grimy and rough around the edges. And that's the way I like it, you know? like. This is street art influence. It's a little rough. It's a little grimy, small independent artist trying to run a shop. And uh, <laughs> I think the vibe is cool. Kind of a little bit of the shop. And then over on this side, oh, 
I gotta show you this. There's this super awesome 3D renderer and, and sculptor that like took one of my characters and made this like sweet statue out of it. I'm gonna try and take the 3D model and see if I can manufacture a bunch of toys. So I wanna get into the toy game. It's another project that's kind of on the back burner right now. This one's kind of uh, 3D printed in this like translucent blue. I kind of want to like paint it a flat color so more of the details will come out. Cause that... But that's super exciting. I've always wanted to get into the toy game. So we'll see if that happens. <laughs> and then this is the gallery area. This kind of always stays open. Like this side is like, oh crazy so much stuff and then this side is like a little bit more gallery-esque and right now we have a show going on called may flowers and it's the follow-up show to a show we did last year called april showers where every piece in the show is in the shape of a raindrop this time every piece in the show is cut out in the shape of a flower and there's just like a ton it's like a garden of art <laughs> so all these artists i think around 150 artists did a bunch of different flowers and stuff there's one that i did Got a crazy like neon one back here. Just a ton of art. And then I got some skateboards here because in July we're doing a skateboard show. So I bought a bunch of blank skateboards and the artists are like coming to pick up their boards. But yeah, each month we do a new gallery show. We have a big art show opening on the first Thursday of every single month. It's totally like party vibes. We have a DJ, we have free drinks. We have a brand new art show and it's like super popping. So yeah, that's kind of the gallery side and that's statics. I gotta show you the bathroom though cause my homie, my homie Claudius Phaedrus wheat paste wallpapered the whole bathroom. And he's like one of my favorite artists. He's super dope. Yeah, he just kind of covered it in super sick wheat paste wallpaper. He's really dope. Up on the ceiling there's like Lil Peep or, yeah that's his name Lil Peep. But yeah, he's, He's one of my favorite artists in Seattle. He's one of my favorite artists, period. So he came in and just rocked this whole bathroom because the bathroom's a little, it's not very nice, but maybe this awesome <laughs> wallpaper will distract you from the fact that the bathroom is not very nice at all. So yeah, that's my little mini statics tour. Thanks y'all for watching. Definitely hit up the contest in the comments. Leave me some questions for the Q&A. Participate in the art prompt. And uh, yeah, subscribe if you're not already. Thank you all so much for watching. Thank you for 100K. This is crazy. And I'll catch you guys on the next one. Ooh, baby.